Hello everybody, welcome to the official replay cast of the Group K Round 3 match between Rock and Aresius. As you can see, it's an Orc mirror. Rock in red, Aresius in blue and white. Very nice blue and white, I have to say. Rock is purely default team. Very sad. But uh, the blue and white looks nice, I think. You can look at the groups here. You can see that if Aresius wins, he'll go to 5 points and qualify... I mean, let's be realistic, in second. Um, and if it's a draw, then Rock will qualify in second, probably. And if Rock wins, he will qualify in first. So, you know, anything can happen. Truly anything can happen, because we could see Serafino as the gr group winner, or Rock as the group winner, or Aresius could qualify. So, all to play for in this match. Rock has won the toss, chosen to receive. Well, there's a blitz, so a disaster start for him. Uh, pretty standard here with four guard. Is it? No, it's only three guard. Only three guard. Mighty blow tackle and leader. Whereas for Aresius, he's got only two guard, two block, mighty blow and tackle. I'm not a big fan of the mighty blow and tackle combination that people are rocking, but understand it. And yeah, this this is a few people have done this build. I don't know if this is like the Spanish orc build or not, but I've seen I've seen a few of this build. And uh, I can tell you that Rock is Spanish, qualified through the season four official ladder. And Aresius is Canadian and qualified through the BBQ World Championship qualifier. So he got blitzed on, but he did remove a guard biggin with mighty blow, because uh Punching things is good. This is a real deep kick, by the way. Really deep. That's pretty big dodge. That's a pretty with it, without that if that dodge fails, you can blitz down here and put a few people in and a few people in there. Could go for all of this. A three stream streak, amazing. How long is the Yaman done? Thanks for watching. Oh, just a push. Well, all threat of getting to the ball in the backfield. Completely gone. No, no, he's got. He's got this little blitzer here, skillless essentially for this game. It's Aresius that has a goblin. Both got trolls. Aresius doesn't have an apple. While Rock does. And the leader, the leader uh, throw is what allows him to have all of the things. Another removal. Mighty Blow being amazing, as it tends to be. Mm, both down. That keeps him on the sideline. Don't go too far forward. And walls off this tackle guy. And this is this is rough for Aresius, isn't it? It's looked so on that he can get something to make something happen, and then he just hasn't been able to. Well, not yet. Oh, didn't like that. I would have liked him to have, like carried on upright, and then uh, the troll could have come in and done both of them. I think. Honestly, I would have liked because because he's just definitely gonna blitz this guy now, right? I would have preferred the one, two, three, four, five, six, rush, rush, right, and base this guy and then then he's gotta fight it's hard though, right? Down two players. It's really hard for uh Aresius already. 
he does have an incredible Mr. Thrall though. Look at this guy. Whoa. Yeah, it's it's actually it's, it's so hard. I don't know what Arises can do now, honestly. Not just get punched. Uh, that can't be the right thing. I always like guard begins. It can be problematic with your rerolls, but like strength four guard is really, really good. And like, you know, bash. Bash fights. Blockers would be better versus like wood elves and stuff. And there you go, look, there's there's the reroll gone. That's the problem. Like, you know, you could just not make that block, right? But uh did. And it make it makes for some awkward rerolls and stuff that you're not really very happy about doing. Wait, well, you pushed him out there. Ah oh, yeah, it's still two. I still think I would have wanted him... Oh no, he's got more players out here, okay. Yeah, so he wants to push him back in. Oh, this is a nightmare. Nightmare for Reese's, isn't it? Just absolutely... ...dominated. Remove the troll, that seems good. Blockless blitz with one reroll. Oof. <laughs> yes, I mean, <laughs> if it's Players that were trying to protect the ball or uh, attacking the ball, it'd be a lot easier. Yeah, yeah. This hasn't gone great for Rock, but the fact that he's made three removals is uh, means he can be a little bit further behind, like a bit further back than he would have liked to be. Players, Reese's to do right. Like this is this is why I didn't play Orcs and wouldn't play Orcs really, because it just doesn't feel like there's much you can do. You know, like even if you know, like now this is a bit different because obviously everybody's pretty good in the World Cup. But like even if you're a lot better than somebody, there's just not a lot you can do with Orcs. You have to like, you know, solve problems. They're limited, so that's why I uh, didn't particularly like them for this or in general. You know, like punching things isn't great, is it? I mean, it's great when it works. The problem is if it, is when it doesn't work, right? And Aresius would just feel powerless now, right? He's just got to hope he can, like, uphill a troll and remove it. Like, it doesn't feel like there's any plays he can make here to get himself back into the game, right? He's just got to punch, make as many two dice blocks as he can, and hope he hurts something. Which I'm not excited about. Though I mean, I think he could have done this better. I think this guy could have been here, and he could have, the troll could have punched this dude, right? So just not activating. Should have won the coin toss, yeah.
I mean, he was slowed down, yeah, by the kick being, like, right in the corner, right? The kick was right in the corner, so because Mr. Throw's so slow, it just... It was always going to take him three turns to... <laughs> four turns to get back to uh, the halfway line minimum. But, uh... I mean, they're not, they're not just ice rolls for removals, but it doesn't feel like, like, you know, like, obviously the good players are playing better than the bad players, but it does feel very limited on how much better you could play than somebody, right? Oh my god, last re-roll gone into a dub skull. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Well, now we can get two dice in the ball, can't we? No. Not like that, though. This guy had to go here, right? One, two, three, four, five. He goes there. And he blocks. And then he hits him. You've got to like... It's actually tough, isn't it? It's actually tougher than it looks to hit the ball. Oh, Troll goes stupid instead of freeing up the big one. So now he's got to blitz his own way off, yep. I mean, you can say that about elves and rolling snakes as well, can't you? Bro, go down there. No rerolls now for Rock. And. Plays just like what? The 1D block? And then rush with the thrower? No. No way, really, Niagara. Yeah, it is an, it is an org offensive state for you. Yeah. You often have to roll a bunch of dice to try and get like, you know, get a guy away and scream. Oh. Is that dub skulls? And then he gets the 1D here. Has to re-roll. Only gets a push. Powers him, blitzes the other dude, and then double rush the score without a reroll. Gets the push. Had to get that orc off to uh, get in. It fails. <laughs> that 1D was wild. To make that 1D and then to reroll it as well was wild. If he'd conserved that reroll, he would have. Uh, he would have been able to re-roll that and scored. Wow. Big advantage for Aresius now. Because he'll get some of these back. But only one shot, actually. Only one shot of the Chaos. He could get them all back. He could get all and none back, right? Anything can happen. The Troll could stay out or come back. There could be a wild variant swing with the Chaos. But I mean, it, it's advantage of Reseus in that he had a successful defence. Only one comes back. And the troll comes back. So, 
Not great KO rolls for Aresius. Rock still on 11. 10. Including a goblin, so like 9.5. Players. One, one and a half players he's down. <laughs> one and a half players. He's got a goblin. And he's got to, and he's got to like pick up the ball and look after the ball, right? Like it is it is generally pretty kind of pretty hard on offense with orcs versus orcs. That was two blisses this game, yeah. This is really inviting the pressure in, isn't it? This is, this is what Rock did a good job of in the first half, was after the blitz, stopping the pressure coming in. Now, yes, he's down a player, but like, like, dude, <laughs> this is, uh, he's not even going for it. He's not even going for it. He's just going to win the big fight in the middle. Definitely tried to pressure a bit there, personally. Very surprised he didn't. Just gonna isolate the troll, which is okay. Hmm. Get the gobble over. Like this is quite nice, right? Because you can you can dodge out the tackler at the end and kind of move over a bit. It's hard to keep the ball safe, isn't it, down players? Rushing to hit for a better final position. Always enjoy the uh, first turn, move the guy back, play, that's good. Oh, mighty blowing the gobble. Block again. Oh no, he didn't block block him. Freed up the uh maybe I'm uh, not sure about that. Maybe she just punched more. Punching more is very good. It's a full pow. And a removal. Down to nine players. Reseus. Can't feel too bad, it was only a goblin. Okay, Blitz is back. Getting this forward is going to be really difficult. 
really difficult. Incredibly difficult. Didn't follow. I thought he'd have followed and then uh, moved in with the troll as well, right? And then 2D that big one. Like, just blocking things is really good. You could, you could max block every game and get to master. I maintain that to be a fact. Probably should like move the thrower up first, right, before I did that blitz in case it was a... Oh wow, a dub skull that he could have eaten. But he doesn't have to eat it, and he gets a removal instead. And now things are looking absolutely horrendous for Aresius. Reroll is that one in nine? No, two. I wouldn't have been too bothered by that one in nine, but never mind. I mean, this is horrific, horrific board position, isn't it? For Aresius, he's got like no players, they're all based. He's in his own half. He's down low to man. Yeah. It's bad. I guess he's just trying to hold out for the... The thing is he needs the win, right? Aresius needs the win. The draw favours Rock. So Aresius does have to win this somehow, but... He's about to get his ball smashed on two dice. <laughs> It's uh, unlucky for Rock that it's he's one shot, right? He'd have to rush to hit with block. Oh, he can't now anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Hitting with block would have been pretty good. But gets the ball down. And a draw will be good enough for Rock to qualify, but not to top the group. It's the knockdown there, gets the knockdown there. It's got to uphill the troll, I guess. And then still not be in a great spot. Oh, dodges out as a scoring threat. Yes, I like that. Oh, goes for the pickup in the tackle zone. Yeah, fair enough. Oh, Biggin gets the ball. Easy. That's actually brilliant. I guess you just blitz the scoring threat then. You, you just have to draw. Can 2D the ball or <laughs> 2D the ball is pretty uh Yes, yeah, so he's not blitzing the blitzer. So 2D the ball instead. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he catches the scatter. With the unactivated blitzer. That is outrageous. What a slice of good luck for Rock. One, two, three, four, five. Rush, rush. He could have dodged double rush, but he's got more rerolls, so I guess that's what he thought. Put some tag. Well, well, brutal dice for Aresius, all game really, he just got banged out instantly and then uh, went into trouble on his own drive, rock scores, 
no messing about, that secures the draw, doesn't it? Absolutely. Rock is definitely qualifying now. The question is, can he win the group as well? Which I can imagine Aresius isn't quite as excited about that permutation. <laughs> Oh, he's got the goblin toss though. No rerolls. Fails the pickle. Sad. Is it? I mean, he could have blitzed the ball right on one D, powered him, ball scattered, picked it up, handed off the goblin who gets thrown. There was a chance to uh, make it 1 1, but I mean, it was ludicrous, obviously. At this point, Aresius doesn't really care too much. <laughs> Completely understandable. And there you go, Rock wins 1 0. And group K, and you can see with that result, Rock wins the group seven points undefeated, Serafino five points undefeated. So, there you go, um, pretty comfortable for those two guys in the end. Congratulations to Rock, commiserations, Aresius. Thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.